chance to speak with him a few weeks ago, and he said that the growth that he has made through his first season with the Avalanche is something that has just been very beneficial. Obviously, a little nervous, he said, in those first few games, but this decor up here really helped him. Welcome into Altitude TV Studios. I'm Katie Florio, joined alongside Katie Goss and Riley. A battle all night long, but you guys find a way to come out on top. A great setup by Holland there. Take us through that game winner. It just looks very, very comfortable. And I think playing with a 929 save percentage up to this point definitely has to give Coach Bednar a sense of relief to yeah. know that you do have someone that is more than capable. But it's not just the stats that really stick out to him. Biggest thing, you can't teach size. Coming in at 6'6", he is just a physical dominant presence and can just naturally overpower really any opponent he faces. He has very good speed on the forecheck. Speaking of power play, special teams, a big factor both nights. What adjustments were made over the course of the weekend to come up when it mattered most. Tanner, first off, congratulations. Played in your 400th AHL game last night. Plenty of NHL games under your belt, too. What can you say about the longevity of your career up to this point? He's a defenseman that, not big in size, but he just has all of the right tools. Kind of like Eustace, he's another guy that is just very poised and very confident in everything he does. He's a fourth line gritty guy, not afraid to throw his body around. He's great on the penalty kill as well. And so as we get into closer to playoffs, it's, it's a tight race. And so those are the kind of guys you need. Ivan, first pro goal, three wins in a row, undefeated at home. How would you describe the way this team is building chemistry every day? Welcome to 80s night at Blue Arena. 